Hi, my name's Peter, and welcome to the Flagstaff Group. Flagstaff is a company based in Wollongong, just one hour south of Sydney. Flagstaff is a unique, multifaceted company comprising of a number of diverse business units, including print and mail, fine foods, paper recycling, light engineering, and commercial laundry. Flagstaff supports an integrated working environment across all its business units, employing people with a disability and those without to create this most unique business model. To tell us more, I'm joined by Flagstaff's Chief Executive Officer, Steve Baird. Hi, Steve. Hi, Peter. So tell me more about Flagstaff as an organisation. Yeah, thanks, Peter. Uh, the Flagstaff Group was formed in 1966 at a time when there was very few opportunities for people with disabilities in employment. Uh, today, the group uh, employs over 350 people in two locations uh, on the south coast of New South Wales, in Wollongong and Nowra. So tell me, how did the business develop? Yeah, the group recognised many years ago that it needed to be in control of the goods and services that it produced and to transact with the end customer. So to do this, they identified certain successful small businesses that specialised in the area of printing, mailing, food preparation, light engineering, laundry and waste management. And how does this make Flagstaff different from other organisations? Well, Flagstaff hasn't changed in its fundamental vision and function to provide employment support to people with disabilities. But what has changed is how that vision is delivered within a commercial environment. Meaning? Well, today it's accepted practice for people with disabilities to be integrated into open employment. Well, in reality, Flagstaff has been doing that for a lot of years. So it's all about creating an integrated work environment that supports people with disabilities uh, over various uh, industries. So our skill is in being able to design a work process that suits a person with disability and then adding to that the appropriate training, uh, equipment and possibly even software. And what that does, Peter, it helps to uh, maintain our productivity and our quality. And you'll see from our workers as you walk around that from the smiles on their faces that this is a, a winning formula. That's great. How do the employees work within this integrated environment? Well, at Flagstaff, we see very little difference between a person with a disability and those without. It's all about providing the best workplace opportunity for the right person and then supporting their professional growth. But the really nice thing about Flagstaff, Peter, is that our team treat each other with integrity, dignity and respect. They really do work together as a genuine team. What about your customers? How do they feel? Well, to be honest, Peter, our new customers often have a natural apprehension uh, when making a decision whether to buy from us, but it only takes a really short time for them to realise that Flagstaff does operate as a real commercial enterprise. We know that we've got to get our quality right, our service right and our price right for those customers to keep coming back to us. And you'll see when you have a walk around, Peter, that Flagstaff has grown over the years, so customers are obviously very comfortable in, in continuing to do business with us. So I think the best thing for you to do now, Peter, is to have a look around the organisation because we find that it's not until people actually have a look around that they realise what a really unique organisation Flagstaff is. That's a great idea, Steve. To tell us more about Flagstaff's print and mail division, I'm joined by its Group Operations Manager, Roy Rogers. Hi Pete, and welcome to Print and Mail. Tell me about Print and Mail. Well, Print and Mail is the largest commercially based printery on the south coast. Um, we're a fully integrated printery, and what I mean by that is we're able to offer a suite of services ranging from high production digital printing, um, offset printing, um, a mail house service, through to our finishing area, and uh, warehousing and distribution of printed articles. We've also recently added document scanning to move us into the paperless world. Before we get into the detail, tell me about how you manage such a large organisation. Well, Peter, we've integrated both automation and taken the skills of our supported workers and upskilled them into areas where they could operate the automated equipment. So where does it all start? Well, in the print industry, it all starts at the graphic design stage. We've got a uh, professional graphic design team employed at uh, Print and Mail 
and their job is to take the customer's requirements and transpose them into print so that one, it looks good when the customer receives the product and two, it's able to be produced and processed through either our offset print process or our digital print process on time with the quality that our customers are seeking these days. Explain to me about digital printing. Peter, digital printing offers our customers the convenience of quick turnaround, so we can print on demand. It's uh, cost effective for short, low volume runs and the technology of digital printing is increasing rapidly. In the last few years we've certainly seen major inroads into the digital quality. That's one of the major reasons why Flagstaff chose to get into digital printing and invest in the technology of putting high speed, high quality machines in to service that part of the market. If you've got digital printing, why does Flagstaff need to use offset printing? Flagstaff needs to be in offset printing as well as digital because that's the only way you can do high volume and the really high quality work that many of our corporate customers expect. So at Flagstaff here we've got, uh, we've got print presses that cover four colour glossy brochures down to our single colour black and white that can get used for things like pads, uh, docket books, uh, invoice books, that sort of thing. So what happens when the print run is completed? We take the digital print and the offset print and that gets channelled into our finishing department and the finishing department's job then is to put together the pieces of paper that we've printed and make those into a, uh, a booklet or a docket book, a pad, uh, whatever the customer's uh, requirements have been. Now in that area we've also invested in equipment again so that our people with disabilities can uh, operate that equipment and we've got uh, automated stitching machines, drilling machines, collating machines and uh, shrink wrap so the goods can be shrunk wrap or they can be boxed and then dispatched. Now if we need to we can also put it in our um, warehouse and uh, we can deliver to the customers branches and shops nationally. As a business, how does Flagstaff meet customer expectations? Well Pete, one of the major expectations of our customers is to meet their on-time delivery performance. So that's delivering what they want, when they want it. Now the way we've chosen to do that here at Flagstaff is that we've employed two shift operations. So we run a day shift and an afternoon shift. So that allows us to get the largest job through to the smallest job dispatched and to our customers on time. What additional services can you provide? At Flagstaff Print and Mail we've got the added advantage of having our own mail house. What that means is we can take the printed media that we've printed for our customer and we can mail it out to the customer's clients. We've got the technology in being able to manage our customer's databases. We've got uh, plastic wrapping machines that can do the plastic wrapping of publications and circulations. And is that all your services? No, that's not all we've got. We're also uh, able to have uh, electronic broadcasts of faxes, SMSs and emails for our customers. Roy, it's hard to believe that one organisation can provide so many services to its customers. Oh Pete, it's not hard at Flagstaff. We're a very unique business. Um, we're able to uh, not only have a commercial focus on making sure that uh, we, we service our customers correctly, but we've also invested heavily in technology and equipment and also we've invested in the skills of our people. Recently we've uh, taken on a new business and we're now looking at doing document scanning. Tell me more about this service. In document scanning we've again invested in technology. We've uh, got the best equipment that we possibly can get. Um, we're able to process 8,000 documents a day, scan those documents and place them on our server where our customers can either retrieve them over the internet or we can send the information directly to the customers to retrieve themselves. Roy, it's an impressive business. If I were a customer, how would I get in touch? Well, Pete, that's easy. Either ring our customer service team, they're available five days a week, or you can get on the internet and you can uh, browse our site or send us an email and uh, the customer service team will be happy to uh, meet any of your needs. As you can see, Flagstaff invests in modern technology and machines with the emphasis of getting the job done right. And they train all their staff to work within the process in a highly commercial environment. 
Each worker, no matter what their label, is fully supported and is part of a team with the emphasis of getting the job done. That's the unique Flagstaff model. And finally, Flagstaff encourages those who are interested in seeing this firsthand to let them know and they'll arrange a tour. And I can tell you, it's well worth the effort. <laughs>